For our third example, we have the system 3x subtract 8y equals 5, 9x subtract 24y equals 20. Let's multiply one or the other of these equations by something that we get, in effect, a common denominator for the two coefficients of one of the variables. For our first variable x, we have 3 and 9. A common denominator for 3 and 9 would be 9. A common denominator for 8 and 24 would be 24. The lesser of these is the 9, and so I'll choose to go after 9. I'm calling this common denominator because that's where we've seen it so often. The better name for it, the official name for it, is least common multiple. The least common multiple of 3 and 9 is 9. So let's get 9 and negative 9 as our coefficients. Since the, since the lesser one, I'm sorry, since the lower one, the 9, is the way I want it. I'll leave it unchanged. That is, its multiplier will be 1. For the upper one, the first equation, I'll multiply by negative 3 to create a coefficient of negative 9 for the x. So multiplying the first equation by negative 3 gives us negative 9x plus 24y equals negative 15. Then 1 times the second equation gives 9x subtract 24y equals 20. We've set it up so that the negative 9x and 9x will cancel. That is, they add up to 0. And then we add 24y and negative 24y, but wait a minute. 24y and negative 24y also cancel. That is, they add up to 0. And so on the left-hand side of the equation, I have simply 0. On the right, negative 15 plus 20 is 5. And so we have 0 is equal to 5. Remember from your earlier work that when the variables completely disappear in the algebraic solution method, we saw this in the substitution method, remember, when the variables completely disappear, the numbers that are left make an equation which is true or which is false. This time, 0 equals 5 is false. That means that when we try to find a common solution, a common ordered pair for this system of equations, we find it is impossible to do so. We come up with a false statement. That means that these two equations have nothing in common. That is, there is no solution to this system. No solution is our answer. Now you should be ready for some exercises. I'm giving you two systems. The instructions are solve by the addition method. Solve by the addition method. Exercise one is the system 3x plus 4y equals 11. 2x subtract 2y equals 12. Exercise 2, 4x subtract 2y equals 6, 6x subtract 3y equals 9. Copy these two systems down, then stop the tape, solve them bo both by the addition method, and restart the tape to check your answers. Your answer should be, for exercise 1, the ordered pair 5, negative 1. Be sure that is written in parentheses. For exercise 2, 
the set of all ordered pairs xy such that 4x subtract 2y equals 6. If you did not get these correct or have other questions that need attention from a lab instructor or a tutor, be sure to make note of that so that you can get help when you go to the lab. This concludes math tape number 093.